Hello everybody, welcome to Pokemon Survivor Island Season 1, Episode 17. Before we get to Tribal Council, I have some quick updates for you guys. So basically, just letting you know, if you have an immunity necklace, if you win the immunity necklace or hidden immunity idol, you may give it to anybody in your tribe. So like, for example, let's just say, I'm going to make this up completely. Let's say, uh, Ampharos wins a hidden immunity idol, he says, Halucha. I'm going to give this to Shinx or something like that. And then he'll have to tell Shinx and Shinx will have a hidden immunity aisle and nobody else will know but Shinx and Ampharos. There you go. Um, and by the way, um, from now on, uh, sometimes I know you can forget, um, but I say, you know, usually I ask you your question then ask who you're voting off. Um, sometimes you guys miss that, and then I just ask you, uh, okay, thanks for submitting, but also who are you voting off, then you'll tell me. But, um, sometimes, in this case, it's happened, it's been over a day, and this person, um, submitted their response, but they didn't tell me where they're gonna vote off, so from now on, if I'm waiting more than a day for you to tell me who you're gonna vote off, but you submitted your other response, then that vote is just gonna count against you, because, um, so it's just gonna be a vote against you, just because you're not, um... You have to submit because we don't want to wait two more than two days for one person to just submit who they're gonna vote off. I mean, we just we just don't want to wait that. So, just wanted to make those updates clear. You can give your hidden immunity idol, and even if you have one right now, or if you have an immunity necklace right now, and you want to give it to anybody in your tribe, go ahead. Let me know. Just PM me or just comment. But or uh, if you have an immunity necklace, you can comment below. But if you want to give it to somebody, uh, let me know because that would make blind sides and everything more special and. A blind side is basically, you know, you know, this person is projected to be voted off, everybody hates him or something, but then somebody gives him an immunity idol or something, and then um, all those votes against him don't count, and then, you know, somebody else um, gets a vote, and then one uh, somebody else gets one vote. So let's say, I'm just going to make this up, so let's say Ampharos has an immunity idol, and everybody wants to vote off Carbink. This is not true, I'm just making this up. And everybody votes off Carbink. Except, obviously, Carbink has to give one vote to somebody else, right? So everybody votes off Carbink. Let's say Carbo Carbink would uh, put a vote on Mudkip. All those votes against Carbink wouldn't count because he has a hidden immunity idol. So the vote against Mudkip would count, and Mudkip would be eliminated. That's a blind side. Just want to make that clear. Anyways, let's head on over to Tribal Council. So, yeah, we'll catch you guys there. Peace. Alrighty, everybody. Somebody will be voted off tonight. Or, unless we have a tie, of course. But... We'll get on with the questions, and we'll start off with Krogunk, and we'll go down the list. So, Krogunk, do you think you're possibly a top five player in Pokemon Survivor Island? Yeah, I mean, I think I could make it, but, you know, we never know. That's true, it all depends on your performance and everything. So, yeah. Next up, we are going to move on to Eevee. So, Eevee. Will being the only one in your tribe with an immunity necklace put a target on your back? I mean, I think it could put a target on my back, possibly, but um, it all depends when I use it and uh, when I don't use it, so, yeah. Alrighty, next up, we will move on to Salk. Now, Salk, do you think you and your tribe are smart? Do you think you and your tribe are smart enough for not being in an alliance? Well, I am in an alliance now, but I'm not going to say with who. But, um, I mean, let's say if we weren't in alliances, I think it would be smart, but... I feel a little bit safer in my alliance. Alrighty, that's true, it's an alliance, you don't have to tell anybody, that's completely up to you. So let's move on to Tyrant. Tyrant, is it possible your tribe can fall behind Tribe Dialga based on your tribe's performance? I mean, it seems like we're starting to fall, but I think for some reason they're just going to trip up, so no, I don't think we're going to fall below them. Alright, next up, we'll move on to Meowstic. Now, Meowstic, is the rumor true that you are one of the most hated Pokemon in this game? No. That was just a rumor that Trigo brought up a while ago. People couldn't think of buying. Maybe some people hate me and, you know, I'm not sure yet. I, I don't know if people hate me or not. Alrighty, and I'm pretty sure we've done everybody. Am I correct? Let's see here. Uh, I think we still have to do... No. Alright. 
we still have to do final one, Espeon. So Espeon, is there anyone you can really trust and really rely on in your tribe? Honestly, I don't even know anymore. You know, after being voted in the last episode, I can't trust anybody. Um, you know, my ally kind of left and... Oh, I'm, I just don't want my tribe to go against me or anything, but I, I can't really trust anybody. I'm just going to be careful and just... Just found my for myself and not always rely on the other people. Alrighty. So, now that everybody's answered their questions, it's time. You may all go submit their votes. We'll start with Meowstic and with Krogunk. You may go and start submitting your votes. I'll go get the votes. Now, before I announce the votes, I'm going to ask a question. So, Evie, I know you have an immunity necklace. Are you going to use it tonight? Are you going to play it? I am not. Okay. Oh, wow. Alrighty. Now, if anybody has a hidden immunity necklace and they would like to play it, now would be the time. I will. <gasps> Here. This is indeed a hidden immunity idol. So any votes against Meowstic do not count. So, let's start. First vote. Meowstic does not count. Next vote. Krogunk. That's one vote, Krogunk. Next vote. Sock. That's one vote, Sock. One vote, Krogunk. Next vote. Krogunk, that's two votes Krogunk, one vote Sock. Next vote. Meowstick, does not count. Final vote. Eleventh, the eleventh person voted out, nineteenth place on Pokemon Survivor Island, Krogunk. You have gotten eleventh, you are the eleventh person voted out, nineteenth place. Krogunk, your tribe is spoken. Bye, guys. Bye, Krogong. Thanks for joining us this season. We hope to see you next season. Go back, pack your bags. It's time for you to go. Bye, everybody. Bye, Krogong. All righty. Congratulations, you are all safe. This travel council is over. Now let's head on back to camp for the next challenge. Alrighty, everybody, I want you all to welcome Tribe Pocky back to camp. Somebody was voted off, and you guys saw as he left. I hope you all said goodbye. Krogunk was the 11th person voted out, 19th place on Pokemon Survivor Island. That leaves us with 19 people remaining. I believe. Wait one second here. Let's see. 4, 5, it's 9, plus 5, is 14. 18. I'm sorry. Oh my god. Yikes. 18 people remain on Pokemon Survivor Island. And we will move on to the next challenge right now. It's a simple challenge, and this is a score challenge. Since today is the 4th of July, why not have a little 4th of July fun? So I'm going to ask this question. July, the 4th of July wasn't just called, oh, let's just call it the 4th of July. There was a specific other name for the 4th of July. It's not in, like, Spanish or anything. It's in English. It's just, it's two words. All you have to do, think really hard, what would the 4th of July, what would 4th of July, what's another name for 4th of July? If you cannot think, you may look it up, and you will definitely, most definitely find the answer, because um, I obviously know what it is. It is two words. Now, team that gets um, this word most correct, safe. So, it'll be out of 9 for you guys, out of 5, and out of 4. So anyways, thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, donate for more content. Remember, the question is, it will be in the description, what was another name for the 4th of July? Thank you for watching. Peace.